everybody what's going on Eric here hope everyone's doing well out there and I am back with the now custom restoration of Wally in a Box's Kramer guitar and I'm very picky when it comes to stuff now I showed in the video what I did the other day with the headstock and it looked good I liked it I liked it a lot in fact it kind of gave me a little bit more of an idea to add something to it because it was still too plain it was just missing something all right so i kind of added something a little bit to it now with me even though everybody else thought it was cool and they liked it and stuff like that um if i don't like it and everybody else does that's cool but personally for me uh i'm going to end up redoing it over again and that's kind of what I did here. So, I was looking at it this morning. The can says that, the spray can says, cures in 24 hours. So I was like, okay, fine, let's test that theory. I used the fingernail theory, pushing it down on the, the paint of the headstock in a corner, and nothing, there was no mark. So okay, it's cured. So I cleaned up the residue from the glue 1500 grit sandpaper sanding back the sharp line that the tape made with the paint kind of like goes up against it even though you're putting light coats of paint on there you're still going to get a little bit of a bump where the tape line is so I sanded that back everything was still good no problems but it was missing something and I didn't quite like the way that the outside edge around the headstock looked it has that black plastic on top of the headstock and even though I masked under that black uh, I didn't fog in the color on it it looked cool it still had like kind of a nice effect to it where it almost had like a binding effect to it but there's no binding on this guitar I did however get the gold Kramer logo but putting the gold Kramer logo up against what I've done yesterday and what I've done today, um, yeah, it still wasn't, it wasn't right. So I got a hold of my buddy, asked him if he can make me a black. So this is going to be like a little bit of a poll. Would you go with the gold or would you go with the black after you see what I just did here? So I think this time worked out a lot better. Um, and basically, it, it's it's tomorrow. It'll be pretty much it's cured to the touch right now. It was cured enough for me to kind of give it a nice little fifteen hundred grit sanding, um, but it's not cure enough for me to apply the decal to it yet or to coat it with the epoxy resin. But this is what I did: stripped it back down and added another stripe to it and like i said around the edges you were able to see the black around the edges which was all right if it was going to be a binding situation but there's no binding on the rest of the body of the guitar so i had it wrapped i wrapped it around there now the cool thing about this which is kind of nice is going to be the effect that it's going to have um well let me just show you lights out no i didn't forget to pay my electric bill black light time this headstock is glowing like you wouldn't believe right now and the striping is black so i think with the black lettering it'll be much better and, and camera is not really giving this justice right now because it's just coming up as just a glow it's not coming up as the pink with the glow and uh, yeah this is pretty interesting now let me shut this off and go back the other way now what I'm going to do is I'm going to end up doing the same type of striping on the body of the guitar. The striping might be a little bit wider on the body because it's a larger surface. And I'm going to add the third stripe in there as well. Maybe even a fourth, not too sure, because I was thinking about putting another stripe on here as well. Now the way that I did this 
is the same way that I'm doing the body. I painted the white first, laid down the tape, and then put the color on it afterwards. And you can see, no color bleed. So either way, what I did yesterday works, and what I did today works. So, yeah, I think this is going to be a lot better. I like it a lot better this way. Um, I hope I can get the black Kramer logo for this. And I need to get this fretboard oiled. So I need to get this thing done and then oil this fretboard because it needs it bad. It's getting really dry. Anyways, that's my story. I'm sticking to it. And uh, I'm going to start working on the body like probably tomorrow. You guys take it easy. Have a good one. Thank mm -hmm. you.